Right, so today is Transmission Thursday. Actually going to be <laughs> Transmission Mechanic, very new to me. So part of our normal procedure when we take the boat out is I check all the fluids. A couple days ago when I pulled the dipstick on the transmission, it looked milky. I know that that's a sign that water is in there. So what I figured out is I need to replace the oil cooler. That's going to be here today. And what I'm doing right now is I've got a, uh, a little 12 volt pump. So I'm going to pump out the oil that's in the transmission now. I'm learning as I go, so I might seem a little slow. So this is the transmission a cylinder right here. This is the transmission cooler. So the oil comes up from the pump into the cooler comes. This is cooled by seawater here. Oil goes back into the transmission. It's just a little closed loop system. So this is the piece I'm going to replace. So I've got the uh, Rotella SAE 30, which is the recommended oil for the transmission. Little 12 volt pump I've just drained a gallon of oil out of the transmission right here did have a problem where the official drain plug is I don't know if you can see where my hand is but it's behind where the shaft connects to the uh, transmission so I'm gonna have to do it all through the little pump I'm gonna wait for UPS to bring the new oil cooler and then I'll disconnect everything right I've got the uh, transmission drained all the way down uh, through the pump because I couldn't get the drain plug out from the flange on the drive shaft. So I'm going to uh, put in some sea foam, which is a, it's a good treatment in general, but I'm going to put the whole can in just to help uh, take care of any water in there. It kind of, well, the commercial says it kind of takes care of the water, but it kind of gathers it all together. Then I'll fill it with fresh oil and then I'm going to run it for a little while and then I'm going to drain it again uh, at least once and maybe twice before I put in the, the new fresh oil. Okie dokie. Go for it. There goes nothing. So I'm going to fill it with oil and let it sit there while I wait for UPS to come with the oil cooler. Well, you can't say it got damaged in shipping. No. Nope. That's the zinc. That's the pressure gauge. Oil in, oil... Oh, they look like different sizes. Oh, good lord. My initial concern was that the ports on top look smaller than the original unit, and then I also couldn't tell if there was a specific direction the seawater was supposed to flow. If this is the new oil cooler for the transmission, seawater goes in here, comes out here, oil goes in here, comes out here, so it's the seawater that's keeping the oil in the transmission cool. It's time to put it in. This could leak oil, but I got pads down. There's that. <clears throat> Still cool. Cool, that's the name of it. Is that that? Yeah. <laughs> Thing is, got oil in it, so what I need to do is get that pump going again, or just, I'm gonna spill it. the wet back it out. <clears throat> we have anything that's like thin rubber. Can you think of anything like that? I think I cleaned it up. There's like a rubber strip oh, up around there. It can be rubber, it can be something that I'm this metal's not sitting right on here just so it doesn't vibrate. Nice. But this is gonna be perfect. It's, it's exactly the cushion that I need. Wow.
now what's the plan i've got to um uh secure the boat a little bit better in the slip because i'm gonna have to uh run it in gear to get the transmission going we don't Woo! these are just extra lines because obviously we already have lines on the boat but start the engines then come down and check on his work the boat has been secured double secured there we go Whenever you start the engines, you always want to make sure you got good water flow coming out the exhaust. Sometimes it's a living room, sometimes it's an engine room. Tied up in the slip, I'm running the transmission for a while to get some uh, new fresh oil circulated through. Then I'm going to change it again, put fresh oil in, but it's installed. No leaks. Yes. So this, so this, this, ah, oh, son of a go. Ah, Come. oh, they look like different sizes. Oh, no. Yes. 